Inglewood, California, after Baker Mayfield's best performance in his short tenure with the Los Angeles Rams, coach Sean McVay was asked whether the quarterback has been as good as or better than his expectations since Mayfield joined the team on December 6. I think probably better, McVay said. But you guys know I was always a fan of him, and I think has played really well. And you've got to think about too what has done to come in here and be able to play around a lot of guys too that haven't been here, and to be able to lead the charge today. Just an incredible effort. He has been outstanding. On Sunday afternoon, Mayfield led the Rams to a 51-14 victory over the Denver Broncos during a game in which Los Angeles didn't find. The Rams scored on all but the last of their nine drives, when they took over on downs with six seconds left in the contest and took a knee. It was the second time under McVay that the Rams didn't punt in a game. Mayfield was dominant on Sunday completing 24 of 28 passes for 230 yards and two touchdowns. His completion rate of 85.7% was the second highest in a game in his career. Mayfield also set the Rams' single-game completion percentage record, passing Kurt Warner, 2000, and Case Keenum, 2016. Coming off the Monday night game and not really playing well on offense, and obviously, I was frustrated with how I played, Mayfield said. And for us to play a complete game like that, that speaks volumes. Mayfield heavily relied on his tight ends against the Broncos, including Tyler Higby, who had 9 catches for 94 yards and 2 touchdowns. Mayfield has thrown 39 touchdown passes to tight ends since entering the NFL, which is tied for the second most in that span. The guy's a competitor, Higby said. Has a good quarterback. He belongs in this league, and he proved that today. The 51 points by the Rams were the most they scored since beating the Kansas City Chiefs 54-51 on Monday Night Football in 2018.